It's another day for the Said family in central Turkey's Konya. They came here from Aleppo in Syria in 2013. It's been a big change for them. When I was in Syria, I would go to school and also help my father at work after school because I love this printing work. My father had a printing factory. He had 150 workers. The father now owns a small print shop here. Brothers Raid and Rafat work at their father's shop. Raid works at another print shop too. They left Syria because of the war. The family says their factory was bombed by the regime of Bashar al-Assad. And with about 4 million Syrian refugees living in Turkey, many refugees are likely to remain here for the years to come. That's why the Turkish government and the UN's international labour organisation say they're providing vocational training to young people from families like the Saeeds. This project provides vocational training to Syrian and Turkish young people ages 14 and above. We are in nine cities, including here in Konya, where we have 120 Syrian young people. For example, we are training the Said brothers in printing work in line with their father's business. Our participants attend theory classes once a week and work in a relevant business four to five days a week. The UN says 12,500 Syrian young people participate in this program. The Turkish government says it wants to provide the refugees the skills to live a decent life. Back at the print shop, the Said brothers say they are happy and optimistic about their future. Hassan Abdullah, TRT World.